blog, which is Life as a Drug Store Cowgirl. Um, and you can find that at lindsayloomis.com and that uh, is linked below. So today I am going to kind of give a little, not really tutorial, um, first of all let's do outfit of the day. Today is New Year's Eve and I've got a see-through bodysuit on and super sparkly socks and then of course I've got my glittery glittery headband I set up a ring light above my bed so that we can kind of see things better I want to talk about what I pack when I do like a special night away with my husband with Eddie so I'm just gonna start off with some lingerie looks this is kind of a fun schoolgirl outfit I've got the little half white cardigan and a garter skirt and then I really like light colored lingerie but black is always the most popular color obviously but I love a light blue and white so I've got those stockings and then one of my favorite little skirts so that is look number one Next up, we have this white cotton gown. It's kind of got some stretch around the lace and it can slide down the shoulders on either side and there's little, little bells at the end. It's kind of like Renaissance Fair princess, but when I have the sleeves down, it kind of is like very like bathhouse looking Victorian. Got the little slipper shoes and then one of my favorite hand fans i'm a huge fan of anything that's like um marie antoinette style so hand fans are very very much along the lines of that kind of look so the light blue look are, is one of my favorites this uh silky robe right here is actually from my wedding my wedding was part of my wedding night laundry or kind of bachelorette party too. I love the little bow details on there. And then I've got the matching underwear set. This is Oscar de la Renta. Very, I just love it. It's a special occasion. Hmm, I'm so excited. Going along with the light blue Marie Antoinette style is this handmade choker ribbon tied necklace that I absolutely love and then I've also got these cute little these are great to bring on a trip or into a hotel room they are kind of this nude blush pink silicone I think yeah silicone wine glass set and it comes in a little travel bag I think this set is from one of those subscription boxes and then this was a gift a christmas present actually from my best friend she sent me these amazing little these remind me of marie antoinette too they're little bath bombs and they kind of look like little desserts and pastries this one is so cute so I will be bringing that as well. Dean is very much into this vlogging thing. Into baby girl. Yeah. So this next set is something that I only bring with me to hotel rooms because it's so glittery and the glitter kind of gets everywhere, but it's so pretty. It's very like early Hollywood, 1940s glam, kind of with a puffy shoulder. The little stars are so cute. Is that your favorite, Bean? Good girl, yeah. Good girl. Next up are my favorite cute little dressy heels for when we're gonna have kind of a sexy night in. They wrap around the ankle. They're literally like, 
It's kind of embarrassing I have heels this old. I think I got them for a wedding in, oh God, 2005, 2004. And then we are staying in a room that has a really nice two-person jetted tub. So I'll be bringing not only these cute little bath bombs, but this one as well. I've been waiting to use this for a special occasion. The lid opens and then you just put it in the bath and it disintegrates. I'm so excited. This is one last look that I love, but I think I'm going to save it for Valentine's Day. It's just a cute little sheer two-piece heart set, and this is one of my favorite holiday purses. But like I said, I think I'm going to save that where, as these pieces are more for, you know, celebrating his birthday, which is January 7th, and New Year's Eve, all of the above. I think I forgot to show this see-through piece as well. This is something that I got um, as a gift. My wedding shower. And then I pack all of these things. Hi, Dean. I pack all of these things into this cute duffel bag that is from Bando. And it says bonjour all over. Next up, I'm going to show you guys what I bring for snacks and what our favorites are when we do a little night together. So I just went to Target and I picked up some things for our little evening away at a bed and breakfast. First things first, we always have to have Cheez-Its. The first weekend we ever spent together, we got Cheez-Its from, I think we ran to Meyer, which is a 24 hour grocery store here in the Midwest. And so um, we've been getting Cheez-Its for our hotel rooms ever since. And they already had Valentine's Day candy out, so I got the little Reese's Hearts, and Reese's are our absolute favorite. They also had these cute little, these were in the dollar section. So I thought it'd be fun to surprise him and kind of set up a little candy food area. So COVID is still very much present and a lot of things are closed. So I'm bringing one of these old board games that were passed down to me from my nanny. Shine some more light on this shit. Um, this is a super old Scrabble set. I just love it. I love this game and I love the aesthetic too. Funfetti is my favorite frosting and you can just like use your imagination for what that is for cute little um, vanilla flavored marshmallows and then these were on clearance too this is just a little candle set I love to bring little candles with me when we stay at uh, a hotel the scents are winter citrus and pine pomegranate cranberry and black pepper and balsam so that'll smell nice. I love these shortbread cookies. They remind me of my childhood. Also got some little scones. I hope that there's one of our favorite French bakeries open tomorrow, but maybe not because it's gonna be New Year's Day. And then my gummy candy, my favorite. Let's see, there's probably some other things I'm forgetting. Like I always bring my lashes with me when we do an overnight trip somewhere. I love this lash kit. That's from House of Lashes. I always bring a white noise machine and a humidifier, so I will be packing those up to bring. And just in case you haven't seen it yet, this is the little getting ready area of my bedroom. Makeup, we've got some of my palettes up here. I've got way too many. And this is the last holiday with my super cute bedroom tree up. I love it. And then I'll get down my ice cream themed items that are normally down here on display.
<laughs> so Bean is like having a spaz attack. She's ready for me to hang out with her. Um, I hope that you guys liked this. I just wanted to show you guys kind of what I bring with me when we pack and go somewhere fun and cute and romantic. Like I said in one of my recent um, blogs, I want to get into some more like quote unquote adult content. Um, basically just talking about like what a normal um, healthy sex life is because uh, a healthy sex life is and he healthy sexuality is just as important to mental health as anything else. Uh, make sure you like this video and subscribe below and I hope that you have a great day and I will see you soon.